Hello. So earlier on, I decided to harvest the hanging baskets of fire chilies that I've been growing and occasionally testing since June, since the nights are now colder, and I very much doubt that they'd continue to fruit throughout the month. Believe it or not, there were well over 50 chilies in that strainer of varying sizes after I'd come back in to wash them. Once they had been rinsed and had their stalks taken off, I put them in a container with a handful of diced onion pieces, one raw garlic clove and poured in distilled vinegar until the pile had been submerged before blending or rather pulverising the mixture. Lastly, I sterilised a glass jar and carefully poured the paste in before storing it to the fridge where it should last for at least a few months. Oh, and of course I took a teaspoon to the remnants that I had collected around the container and lid for a fly taste. Delicious! Slightly sweet, tangy, but definitely more suited to creamy sauces and on top of biscuits as an alternative to pickle, rather than in your favourite spicy red dishes. It is made with chilies that are completely deserving of their name, thus expect a sharp, nippy heat, and use sparingly. Thanks for watching.